the Thing Charger adds a dock and two USB ports to nearly any outlet. Hello everyone, it is Andrew here from iDownloadBlog. Today I have the Thing Charger. Now this is a small adapter that fits over top of pretty much any standard outlet, adds a dock to the top that works on Android, Blackberry, and of course Apple products, as well as two USB ports to the bottom. It comes in three different versions. You have the standard version, you have the SP version, which adds in surge protection, and then you have the 2X version, which includes the surge protection, but it also has two completely different circuits, so that when you charge something through the USB ports at the bottom, it does not slow down the charging on the top, so it basically supplies twice the amount of power to your stuff that you're charging. By default, it comes with a six month warranty, but if you go online and register, that will bump up to a lifetime warranty to ensure that this never fails on you. The first thing that I noticed when I actually got mine was that it's a little bit smaller than I had expected. That's a good thing. I'm used to the other ones like from Belkin or Griffin that make USB wall outlets, but they're always a little bit bigger than the actual outlet themselves. This one is literally the same size as your outlet, so it's pretty much going to cover it spot on. Though the ones that are slightly larger, they usually have a screw in the center that will replace the center screw on your outlet. So it more permanently affixes it to your outlet so it's not gonna come off at all. These, however, could not do that because you can stack them and that doesn't really allow you to put that screw down the center. On the top, you obviously have the spot where the pin will go and on the bottom, you have two USB ports. It's really nice because on the back of the unit, they actually have a spot where you can store the different tips. So you could have one for USB or for micro USB, one for USB-C, and then a third lightning one that you have plugged in for any other Apple devices. Now the tips go in easy enough. You don't have to force them in there. And on the back, there's that happy little button face there. And that's what allows you to adjust the height of the tip. So if you're gonna have a phone with a case, you need the adapter to sit up a little more, whereas if there's no case, you can have it sit pretty much flush. Now, while this works fine, in practice, I've noticed that kind of when I take off my phone, it easily just undoes that clip and pops all the way up to the top. Not a big deal, it just feels like the tip isn't really clipping in there very sturdily. Obviously, it's making a secure connection down at the bottom, but it doesn't really keep its height all that well. Now there are many different tips and adapters out there. There is a 30 pin adapter tip that'll work with any of the older Apple devices. Obviously there is a lightning tip that'll work with any current Apple devices. And then of course there is micro USB for any Android, Windows Phone, or Blackberry devices. As I mentioned, you can stack these. They recommend no more than two or three, depending on how secure you think it feels. And this allows you to charge any number of different devices, always with the biggest one in the back. So as always, let's start with our pros and cons. As far as pros go, it has those swappable tips, so it works with pretty much any phone. It has two USB ports on the bottom for anything that isn't a phone. It is stackable, you can stack two to three of these on a single outlet, and it has built-in storage in the back for additional tips. As far as the cons go, some of the tips are going to be extra. It only comes with a certain amount, and if you need more or lose them, you'll have to buy them. The tip sturdiness is something to be a little bit concerned about. It just doesn't hold up quite as well, and there's no screw attachment to kind of permanently affix these to your outlet. If you would like to pick one up for yourself, you can find it for about $39 with the link in the description below. If you found this video useful, please go ahead and subscribe, and let us know what you think of the Thing Charger in the comments below. And until next time, this has been Andrew for iDownloadBlog.